So I have talked about the kids that were um, created and abandoned in the Philippines and Britain. So now let's head over to Japan. So this one is titled The Kids Left Behind. It came out in the two, in 2000. Okay, here we go. To Masai Yuichi, it was a love affair. The young sailor who came three years ago to the bar Yuichi runs in Okinawa was muscular and handsome. Every night for three months, he talked to her until he had won her trust. After a year, when she told him he was pregnant, the sailor just laughed. He was a little confused, said Yuichi, 43. He thought it was a joke. When her Texan boyfriend, who was in the um, U.S. Navy, finally realized Yuichi was serious, he told her he had another child and no money. After her son Anthony was born, she learned that the sailor was married to another woman. He moved back to Oklahoma when Anthony was six months old. The U.S. military in Okinawa has left a sad human legacy, abandoned children and Japanese girlfriends. There are some 4,000 Amerasian children in Okinawa. Most of them are fatherless. In a society like Japan's, where conformity is prized, the abandoned relatives have an especially tough time. The children are often often bullied by their peers. The mother who live in shame work to support their children. There is no agreement between the United States and Japan to enforce paternity claims. The most the military can do is to urge servicemen to be good parents. Yeah, right. The abandoned women face a community who sees them as tainted. Yuichi's younger brother and sister have been supportive, but her older sister disowned her. My friends told me, you are stupid. Abortion is better. But I love, but I had the confidence that I could love my child. The, a group of older Amerasian women and men are, um, is trying to fight for the children's rights. In May, they formed an organization called Children of the Peace Network, which plans to, to petition both the Japanese and the United States government during the group's aid summit to demand that they pay attention to the problems of the abandoned Amerasian children. We want the United States military and J Japanese government to recognize their responsibility to these children. So these kids face ostracism, social discrimination, and bullying because they're mixed in a country like Japan. And these men just pumped and dumped and just left them to their own um, to figure things out. This is another reason why I am so baffled that so many Asian women get on these social media apps and condone the PP bros.